Hello everybody and welcome to some Call of Duty Blackout. Guys, welcome back to, I think we're on episode 7 here of the uh, the Blackout series. Guys, welcome back. I hope you guys are doing well. Hope you guys are still enjoying the videos. If you guys do enjoy this one, be sure to slap a like on it. I would appreciate it, my dudes. And um, once again, if you guys are new, subscribe and turn on the notifications. But yeah, once, uh, now that I'm pretty much done self-promoting, let's get a firing range. Let's see if we can get a firing range start here. So yeah, if you guys tuned in for the last video, we ended up getting a 10 kill win, which is pretty decent. I'm uh, currently recording this on the final day of the Blackout beta. So what I would like to do here in today's video is just give you guys my final impressions about uh, Blackout and how I think it's going to do and everything like that. But you guys have been to firing range before. I think you know what's up. Oh my god. Got the level free armor, didn't have to waste it, luckily enough. What the heck's going on here, dude? I'm trying to stay silent because I'm pretty sure there is somebody nearby. Oh god, rampart. Really do not want the rampart. Oof. Alright, two kills off the rip. I think I got a shotgun, right? What I think they should do with the loading in this game is pretty much make it that um whenever you pick up somebody else's weapon, the attachments automatically go on. So for example, like if I've got, you know, like this rampart or whatever, and I swap it out for an ICR, the ICR will automatically get all of the attachments that are applicable to it, without me having to like, you know, footer through them and mess about with them. That would be one thing I would absolutely love if they were to do that. Um, so yeah, that's probably like, honestly, like I'm absolutely loving the beta by the way, just in case you guys are wondering, you know, if I'm just complaining because I don't like the game or whatever. Absolutely loving the beta. But um, I would say that's probably like my number one complaint, apart from armor. Which, you know, everybody's complaining about, sort of goes without saying at this point. That armor is pretty, pretty broken. Um, if it was me personally, if they're going to keep level 3 in the game, I think it needs some sort of a nerf, to be honest. Um, you know, like the nerf of being able to sponge so many shots. And I feel like level 1 and level 2 should be your main difference in armor. Um, I'd be pretty happy with if that was the case. This little hut normally has got some good stuff for me. Be pretty well in this little hut. Uh, apart from that, the only thing that I would also like to complain about is, you know, there's a few tiny little quality of life things, like for example, you know, if you shoot somebody to like 1 HP and the, you know, they're in the gas, the, the gas will kill them and you don't get the kill. Stuff like that, you know, a few tiny things which we're not really going to get into. Or like, you know, the way you have to open garage doors by using the button instead of just pressing the door in the middle. You know, I'd like to be able to just be able to press it anywhere sort of thing. So a few little... Guy up there. You reckon he's up there? Thought I heard somebody. I hear him for sure. I've got awareness on though. He's probably like over here. Yeah, I feel like awareness and dead talents definitely need nerfed. Um. Awareness, you can like really freaking hear people from a mile away, dude. I don't think you should be able to hear people from so far. It's actually kind of confusing, bro, awareness. Kind of confusing. You think people are closer than they actually are. Yeah, but that's pretty much it, guys. The sound, the uh, the armor, a few quality of life fixes, which should be pretty easy for Triarch to fix. And the looting. Apart from that, I absolutely love this game. Absolutely love it. Yeah, absolutely love to see when the just give you free kills like that. It's great. What you got for me, buddy? Pretty sure I've already got one of those. I feel like this area is probably more like popping than firing range nowadays. I don't know what happened. Firing range it used to be so nice. 
All right, let's take our stuff off here. Like, instead of me having to do all this, what gun did you have? The N90s. I actually think we were using this in one of our wins pretty recently. The KN. The young KN. All right, now we're gonna have to do all this. Put this on, put this on, put this on. Now we've got a deck to decay in. We're looking good. Probably will go and get the guys like smoke grenades and shit. The smoke grenades are definitely underused, I feel like. I'm in such a bad position here. I'm so stupid for doing this, dude. Oh, trauma kit. Good thing I checked it again. Okay. Alright. That was, that was horrible. But yeah, uh, now that I've finished being negative everything now, let's talk about like the really positive things, the things that I really love about this game. I actually love, like, in a way, I love the looting system. Now, I'm not talking about like the actual, you know, picking up of items, but I mean more like, you know, like the uh, cool stuff, for example, like going and killing zombies and getting an MP40 off zombies, or out of the mystery box, getting an MP40 or getting like a Galil getting special weapons for going to certain parts in the map. For me, I just love that, bro. I absolutely love that. Just adds a little bit more variety to looting in the game. And like, the guns aren't even OP or anything, it's just, it's cool. That's all it is. Just a cool little thing, like an extra little feature, the ray gun. You know, it's not that great, it's only got 20 bullets. But it is really, really cool. And actually, I was talking to Shanks, my friend, um, about, you know, imagine if like, for example, one box of rockets are like, a couple of rockets equaled one clip of the ray gun. That'd be pretty sick. If they somehow work that out. Yeah, but this game is just so cool. Love the map, love the colours, the shadows, the effects. Love Matilda. Absolutely love Matilda. Matilda's great. What's my other weapon? The ICR. Matilda, what do you got for me, bud? Like this perk a lot. Matilda, what do you got here? What was in here, buddy? Not much. Cordite, okay. GG, Matilda. Until next time, my friend. I will never forget you. Never. Never, Matilda, mark my words. One day we'll meet again, Matilda. But yeah, I love the colours, like even like just like the roses and shit everywhere. Beautiful map, beautiful shadows. They, the performance is just top notch, bro. Like even for Call of Duty, I was sort of surprised at how well the game actually runs. I didn't think it would run this well. I felt like there would be areas around the map where it's got frame drops and all that kind of stuff. Um, yeah, like I said, the cool areas, like the zombies areas is really cool. All of the, you know, best areas from Blackout, or Black Ops, sorry, um, are spread around the map. Just, it's so much fun, dude. It's such a cool game. Um, but yeah, those are my impressions. Uh, hopefully, hopefully you guys agree. Let me know what you guys like and dislike in the comments. Yo, let's go and check out this chopper and see what's up. Apart from that, you know, this is not really a problem with the game, but just campers, bro. Camp them with level 3. When you come up against those guys, you hate to see them. At least I like use my level 3 to fucking get up on people's shit, you know what I mean? Oh yeah, is this a chopper spawn? Oh, that's unfortunate. Unfortunately, my, my aim is potato. That's the unfortunate thing. Hopefully these guys have an armor for me. Oh, 
Oh no. Dude, everybody was coming to that area. Everybody was coming to that area. Since this is going to be our last chance to record, we'll record one more part to the video. Um, but yeah, like I said, guys, let me know what you guys do think, and we'll see if we can take a dub. All right, here we go, folks. Part two of the episode. Uh, you know, there was a lot of action. I don't know what was going on. Maybe everybody had that park, and they could see the helicopter. Everybody had engineer on were, like, fighting for the chopper. Yo, I probably should have just dipped in that thing, dude. That's probably what I should have done. Once I got that loud, just dipped. That guy had the angle, though. So unfortunate, dude. That's, that's Call of Duty for you, though. Or that's just Battle Royale in general for you. Here we go, folks. We're going to spawn in to, uh, to finish off in Nuketown. I'm going to see if I can get some kills off the rip here. I've uh, been trying to record this episode for about a couple of hours here. Like I said, the beta is almost finished, so my time is running out to uh, get another gameplay. Yeah, and I absolutely can't wait. Um, probably in the meantime, probably going to be playing some H1Z1. There's a game called Ring of Elysium. I don't know if you guys are familiar. It's a brand new game that's coming out. Uh, by the way, there's a potential crate spawn in that boss over there. Bro, can I get a weapon? Like, Don't let me go to Nuketown and not get a weapon. Come on, this has to be the one. It's ammo, dude. It's finding ammo. Oh, I'm just, I'm just blind. Never mind. Vapor X. I wonder does he uh, check for the for the spawn? Maybe he missed it. He mightn't have known that it existed. Hopefully. Yeah, if you guys are coming to Nuketown, I'm just gonna show you guys where the uh, the military box spawns. Right in here. I uh, I think in the anyway, guys. Like I was saying, if you guys tuned in last time, we got the uh, the ten kill win. We we're pretty close to Nuketown Island. Just on the edge of it, really. Yo. Do you know what would be sick, bro? If you had the crossbow? That crossbow that, um, allows you- oh shit. <laughs> if you had that crossbow that, like, the explosive one, pretty much like a claymore, you could just claymore somebody coming out of here. Yo, just, like, put the claymore right here. If I ever do that, that's gonna happen. You guys are gonna see that on my channel at some point. Oh my god. Did you get him? Did you get him, buddy? Who are you shooting at? I'm really not sure what happened. But in any case, I got to dip on out of here, folks. Right, here we go. Two kills on the board. We're going to hop this ATV. Get the fuck out of here. Before anything, anything bad happens. ATVs are nice. They're definitely the best vehicle to go for. See, I guess that's another thing to talk about, the driving. I guess I wish the driving was more like if you're playing like Forza Motorsport or whatever, or like just generally how driving games normally are. That's what I wish the driving was like. You know, I wish you could... Oh, shit. I'm not gonna fall into the trap of shooting zombies. Where'd this guy go to? You think he just stepped on us? 
He probably has no idea what happened to me, like. I feel like I should see him right here. I've seen a crossfire. I'm blind, I'm sorry. Oh, okay. I think that's a different guy. That might have been the Nuketown guy. But are you not going to go for your loot, or... Maybe you're, like, getting it through the... the wall? Is that, the, is that the same guy, do you reckon? Alright boys, free kills, 29 left. No matter what happens here, folks. This will be my, my final game on Blackout. Yeah, if you guys haven't left a like already, show some love to the like button. Give me some good luck good luck likes out there. But yeah, apart from that, man, I'm, I am going to try to focus up here, but... Well, hopefully we've, we've got a minute to chill. Life's been good. I uh, hopefully will get back to streaming quite soon. Just like, the cool thing about making videos is I can keep making content for the channel, but I don't have to commit to hours upon end at once, you know? Um, which is good for, you know, helping Yumi with the baby and feeding him. It's such an amazing feeling, guys, if you've... I'm sure if you guys are parents, it's actually amazing, like, to, to say that I'm a parent, it's honestly crazy to think about, like. It's unreal how the times went on. I think his armor a little bit for him. He's pissed. I'll tell you that much for free, folks. Oh, he's pissed. He ain't too pleased. Did he have a sniper? He must have done. The reason I think he did is because he was standing still. Like he was hard scoping something. Yeah, we need a menu. Give me something good. Yes. Let's go. Yeah, I'll continue that conversation after. But yeah, like I said, it is an amazing feeling. Just seeing him and like seeing how he looks like me and stuff. I've got like a little mini me. I can teach whatever I want. Other shells not connecting. All right, folks, we're gonna win this game. Final beta. Final day, final game. I believe in us, dude. Yo, let's see if someone's eating my ass, bro. I need to catch this shit, Brondo. Yeah, this is all the heals I've got. That was a guy just standing there. Some shots up here. Maybe some suppressed shots. No. Alright, we're, we're chilling for a minute here. Probably could make an earlier, earlier push. Let's 
ja. I'm not silently, so it should be good. Oh, I hit the paladin. Let's go. Okay, what did I just drop? ICR. What's this? Oh yeah, we'll keep the vapor. Oh. This guy. I don't think so, buddy. Let's go. Love this site, by the way. Love this park, also. Oh, that was a guy. There'll be a guy in there, like. There'll be somebody making a late push here as well. This is kind of horrible for me. And, well, at least we're getting the raid finish. I was saying earlier. We're not really getting a lot of raid finishes, so... I guess I'm kind of getting what I want here, kind of in a in a backwards way. The final showdown at raid. The final beta showdown. I'm I'm 100. I have to win this game, dude. Oh, don't do that. There's somebody here. I'm probably not going to need this. any armor for me. Let's go. Clusters. In a nine bag, sure. I need sure. Bro, this is tense. Where is that from? I like the spot. Probably a guy up on that mountain though. I don't really know raid. But well. Please don't snipe me, please don't snipe me. I can know the multiplayer map, like this area, I'm loving this right now. But uh... I don't know where people can be. Like outside the, the map, if you know what I mean. Yo, the final showdown at raid, though. I'm not gonna lie, pretty nervous.
Had to itch my nose. Oh. Almost died. I'm gonna wait here just in case somebody's making the the late push as well. Try to keep my head glitch as much as possible. See, somebody can just come over that wall and eat my shit, bro. Looks like I'm just out. Oh no, I'm just in. Three people alive. I feel like we're all camping right now. Eight seconds, dude. I'm hoping this guy isn't behind me, that's all I want. Yes, let's go. <laughs> let's go. That was so weird, bro. <laughs> oh my god. Another 10 kill win. Another 10 kill win. Yo, let's go, boys. So, guys, gotta say, I've had an absolute blast, bro. I can't believe this game's gonna go. I can't believe it. Imagine Treyarch extends the beta. That's what I would absolutely love. Yeah, that's my third solo win today, bro. Today. I've been recording a, a decent amount today. If you guys did enjoy it, we got yet another 10 kill win. That's our magic number. I think our second place finish a few episodes ago was a 9 kill second. So this is definitely... Yo, look at this. Just chilling here, by the way. This is definitely my magic number. But yeah, like I said, guys, leave a like on the video. It, it does help a lot. Subscribe if you guys do happen to be brand new here. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys whenever the game fully releases. Until then, we're probably going to be sticking with the H1Z1, the Ring of Elysium, and all that kind of stuff. But much love, guys. I appreciate you guys for watching. This has been King Plays. Good luck and peace out.